so guys today i want to show you how to wire the control circuit of direct online starter direct online starter is a starter used to start three phase induction motors it provides an economical and safe way of starting and stopping three phase induction motors so this is how we connect the control circuit of direct online starter we start with looping power from this terminal here and then connect this power to this single phase MCB which switches on and switches off the control circuit. From the output of the single pole MCB we connect this cable and then connect it to terminal 95 of the overload relay here terminal 95 we connect the cable to terminal 95 here of the overload relay we connect this cable to terminal 96 of the overload relay after connecting the cable to terminal 96 of the overload relay we connect it to the input of the stop push button which is a normally closed contact which is a normally closed switch we connect it to the input of the stop push button here We connect this cable to the output of the stop push button. We connect this. As we connect it there, we connect this cable which goes for hold on. Connect these two there at the input of the start push button. This is for hold on. We connect it to terminal 13 of the main conductor. This is 13 of the main conductor. At the output of the start push button, we connect, we connect this cable. At the output of the start push button, which is the green one, we have connected this cable and we are going to connect it to A1. We are going that is the coil of our main conductor. This is A1. We are going to connect it A1 here. We connect this cable to 14. And this cable we are taking it to A1 together with the output of the start push button here. We have connected them to A1 like you can see. From A2 here, you can see A2, we are going to connect a neutral. This is, we have connected the neutral to A2. Now we can test our circuit. We are going to switch on our power circuit, then switch on our control circuit, and then we test. You can see our conductor is now energized, power is flowing to the three phase induction motor. If we stop, if we start, our conductor.